Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Physiology Learning. In today's Explain Why series, we are going to understand why wounded soldier often does not feel any pain in the battlefield. This is very fascinating concept because they are wounded severely, still they will not be feeling any pain in the battlefield. Obviously, they will feel the pain afterwards. Let's try to understand the reason behind it. The reason behind this is there is a system in the body called as stress induced analgesic system. Whenever the body is put to severe stress, it releases some substances which reduces the pain sensation. There are two different mechanisms for it. First thing is there is a region in the brain called as amygdala which is a part of a limbic system. This limbic system or the amygdala, what they do is they help in controlling the motivational and emotional aspects of the pain. What it does is here the strong emotion is stopping the pain. The amygdala it is going to produce a substance called as norepinephrine. This norepinephrine is going to act on the dorsal horn of the spinal cord and they will inhibit the pain which is getting transmitted to the central nervous system. So this is one mechanism and the another mechanism is there is release of huge amount of endogenous cannabinoids. What are these cannabinoids? These cannabinoids are substances which can produce the euphoric effects. These cannabinoids, they are going to act on the cannabinoid receptors, the 1 and 2 and they will produce the euphoric effect also. So because of these two reasons, the soldier in the battlefield does not feel pain even though they are severely injured. I hope it's clear. Thank you for listening. We'll see in the next video. Thank you.